Teddy Dow. Big ranking above. Look what I've been ranking a billion cable banana called the book of the quitter. She's coming here to the college of Mandan Mitchell and Nancy. Take care of one of one of the bad one. He liked that he's going to bend and one echo of a billion carrier coat. And I'm going to carry it. Nancy Tavadish, you will live and long. Kau cian aku beli lu aku tunggu aku kau diri aku beli anak aku tu kelir. Ya, tunggu dia baru jadi yang mana? Anwar, bati yang cian, dia yang cian cian. Amar aja ni albiam mana? Eh, lari. Eh, cian cian ni aku kena anwar. So very good, thank you. Jilai dan Ted. Eh, kau kau tu macam kau kau tu cik cian kan? Kau nak beli apa cik Jojo? Kau screen kau cik Jojo ada problem. Tu kau kiri ada cik cik tu bana link. Lalu kau kui juga ni, kau kui juga. Ngaji dia kau. Lalu tak ada itu kau. Si kau nak korup mana kau? Gol cik, eh wood kagat ke kuakin mana bulkin ke? Kencang itu juga. Mother, the father, children. Dulu kenapa tu mana right? Ke Queen tu ke juga? Ni ada siapa yang tahu? Kenapa tu me? Eh, le yang tu, le yang anu tu di reda rukun. Jin Wood, ye ni cek ke cek, ye ni cawu tu kagat ku. Dah ye tu kan yud, rodu ni di racing dun. Kan tu? Amin ini. Dalam pek, dalam kia amit cek cek. How short it is or how long it is? Kajang gor kau no bana ling kang gua tu mak amin ini di cek cek. Riat yang mana orang kopi dah lari dan niam. Abai and bagai cicing. Abai and bagai cicing. Abai and bagai cicing. Cicing dia kata ke ke abai muda beri cicing dia itu. Dia punya kawan lari dah ke long. Dah kau kemen, kau 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 nunggu ni. Mesti dia wah wah ni dia kau nak hari je. Ladi aje dah buaru. Kalau ladi aje dia dia jadi ramu pot pot. Dah kau kau kau. Enua brand juga en nak je. En nak je. Jangan dong. It's difficult for me to say that. Women are very shy. Yeah. 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 Aje, aje ngan. Si tor muzio betul kalau ane nak aje. Tapi kalau itu mana? Dia aje nak tiri aje. Si kau nak guru bana nongra. Kecara aku bukai beri cing. Oh, cina itu orang aku cikkan lalai aje. Sometimes very difficult. Unless. Aje nak aje. Mukaan kandang juga nanti aje. Bas and wire out yet. There are a number at the Muda. Number at the Muda. And we'll be our knock. Just come in, say a knock. Amen. To go and take Babuaro. Number at the Muda. And we'll be our knock. Just come in, say a knock. And I'll write your one. And I'll tell you. Hey Jesus, yes, we're not here, man. I hope you are not taking my money. 
This is what Jesus told to us. Can I tell you what you have to do? I would have to do the right thing. How many of us are happy with the right thing? I would have to do the right thing.
Mais tout ce que tu as dit, tu as dit que 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 Mais non, c'est Joseph. Joseph,
Let's look at the word of God, Psalms 1 and 2, and before let's have a word of prayer. Father, reveal to us your goodness. Regardless of the pain, the sorrow, help us to know your will and live for you, committing ourselves into your throne. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Bakula manane biya faru e jo do kum nyal. Bakum manane changkel. Kaba manane biro te a te amo. Kaba manane biye de be de ru te de amo. Kaba manane biye do a de te sin ni si amo. Ka chang de ke no we. Yeah. Ka bi guan te a do ya ka manane. Please read it again with strength. Because it's a word of God. Please don't read like a storybook. Come back and It says, How long, O oh Lord, will you hide, uh, forget me forever? How long, O oh Lord, will you hide your face from me? How long, will you hide your face from me? I wrestle with my thoughts. How long will I have sorrow in my heart? How long will my enemies rejoice over me? We asked ourselves yesterday how long. And it's clear all of us in life have reached a point where we have asked God how long. This is something that we struggle with in this life. Because life is difficult for each and every one of us. And when we struggle in this life and trusting God, we wonder. How long do we have to continue to struggle? We have to struggle in our lives. And as we ask this question, I told you how I asked this question. When I had the accident, and for two years I could not walk, for one year I was bedridden. I could not feed myself. I could not do anything because I had been injured seriously. And after two years ended, remember I told you I got the accident in 2018. I said I had the accident uh, in 2018. Two years later, 2020. Now I was walking with two crutches. Uh, as long as I could walk, I was thanking God. You also remember I told you I went to the US where I got my treatment in Loma Linda. And I thought, now that I can walk, I can go to Loma Linda. And I thought, now that I can walk, it would be nice for me to go home to Kenya and see my friends and relatives. And I was cursed with my doctor. I was cursed with my doctor. And the doctor said, I want to see you after three months. But you are not strong enough to go. You are under very heavy medication. Especially for your back and your brain. The ribs had healed completely. The hip was so much better. My arm, I could use it. I could move my neck. But the injuries that I was struggling most with was my back and my brain injuries. 
Roman be long a yoga can uh can a wither. And I told the doctor, instead of me staying here for three months, let me go home to Kenya and I will be back in three months. Then that doctor no and would take a pet down job and water and I am a little kin, but could all be yoga core for the audience. And the doctor said, Lois, you know it has been a long journey. I wish you could be patient. And I told him, no, doctor, I need to go home. So I got on a flight and I came home. And when I came, got home, I was so happy to see all my relatives, my friends, who were praying for me. And as I walked with the two crutches, I was so happy that I finally could walk. Remember the doctors had said I'll never walk again. And I told the doctors God has a final say. The doctor said I'll be in a wheelchair permanently. I will never be able to use my mind. Again. But I looked at the doctors over and over again. And told them, You are the doctor saying. But my God has been no for Being happy amongst my friends and relatives. And we will not have a good time. I continue to preach the word of God. And I had lost my voice during the accident. And I had lost my voice during the accident. As part of the issues I had because of the accident. As part of the issues I had because of the accident. Go and go a kill, Katari, and make a job, go to the Albatra. My voice was coming back. So when I would go to preach, uh, what the joke of the world, I would say, Jesus, Jesus. Uh, Larga, no, yes, you will know again. Uh, yes, no, cause. My voice could not come out completely. And I was determined to continue to preach the word of God. Regardless of how my voice was being projected. After a little while. As I continue to preach the word of God. I was to preach the word of God. And as I continued to heal and preach the word of God, well, then you point the word of God. 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 Well, then and then immediately, uh, the doctor said, "Well, I think you should go home." Immediately, and then immediately, the COVID stroke came. The coronavirus hit the world. The coronavirus hit the world. The coronavirus came directly to me. And the doctor said, "Well, I think you should go home." The coronavirus hit the world. The coronavirus came directly to me. And the doctor said, "Well, I think you should go home." COVID. I was bedridden again. I could not walk. I could not feed myself. And they took me to hospital. And they said, your lungs are very weak. And that is why COVID has hit you so hard. They started treating you cannot talk about the kind of point of the argoa. They continue to treat me. Why they move in the middle of the point of the argoa? I could not breathe on my own. Can I could not breathe by myself? Can no longer hear. So I use the machine for breathing. Yeah.
deep anguish. Not only anguish, but deep anguish. Deep anguish. She was just doing her job, just doing her duty alone, madam. And weeped bitterly. Can you now wear? He did. She was not only weeping. Eh, she wear for what? But she was weeping bitterly. Oh, wear alone, can wear with duty alone. Because of her poor wife. Eh, go check on the job there. Penina. Ni Penina. Who used to laugh and mock? Menaja, menaja, dol. God, how long? If you read that chapter, we are told that year after year after year. Uh, Hannah had no children. Uh, Anna, Hannah had no children. Hannah had done nothing not to have children. Anna, tell me to lack the door. The Bible tells us that God had closed His womb. Her womb. Uh, God had, yeah, the Bible says that. Yes. Uh, she, she to look at again. But yet, people made fun of Anna. And her husband and Hannah would say, Hannah, why will you continue crying? And Penina would laugh and laugh. She has no children. Uh, you can't ask she's useless, no children. Hannah kept on praying to God. If Anna had no children, she would have been crying bitterly to God. She would have been crying bitterly to God. Where alone? And asking God. God. How long? The question of how long. When we read the book of Jeremiah 1 verse 5, we are told that God had said, Jeremiah 1 verse 5, 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 God had said, Jeremiah we are, told, we are told that God knew us before we were formed in our mother's womb. God was able to pick us before we were born in our mother's womb. No one is an accident. No one was born without God watching you to be born. Because we know, we are told that He knew us before we were formed in our mother's womb, and He sanctified us. He anointed us. Sometimes we reach a point and wonder, am I really the child of God? And we read the book of uh, first, uh, the book of uh, Psalms 139. Uh, 13 and 14 139, 13 and 14 That we are fearfully and wonderfully made But David said Let's read the whole chapter Let's read the whole chapter if we are fearfully and wonderfully made, and God knew us before we were born, why do we suffer? Why do we continue to suffer? Remember, I said none of us is an accident. And just for you to know, none of us is an accident. Uh, uh, I know we have children here, so I'll try to put it at uh, the best way possible. Uh, out of 100 million seeds, uh, 100 million seeds. Quite a million to four. That your father had. Tente, tembara, reigur. God picked you. Chukulu kan reigien kaken. And took you to uh, quite a, one a selection. And took you into a selection. 
Also 1,000 eggs of your mother. So picking, picking you. One out of all this. One out of 100 million. And being able to join you with over 1,000 eggs. So he picked you there and he picked you here for you to Out of all the children that were born during your day you were born, we have over 42% that have already died. So God selected you and he picked you and he sanctified you before you were born. Look at yourself and say, I am not an accident. Say that.
So we have agreed that God selected us before we were born. We have also said that we are fearfully and wonderfully created. We know this, we know. So when you walk, walk with your head up high. Don't be walking like this, women. Uh, Walk like this. 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 Walk like we trust in God. We love God. We are serving God. But we ask how long? For another one year. Uh, I struggled with COVID. You find yourself that you leave one problem. And you jump into another problem. That life is so difficult. Things don't seem to fall in place. And you ask God, how long, God? Maybe it is your health. Uh, Maybe it is your family relationship issues. That, you know, we are told in the Bible that for a man they would love, rather live on the top of the roof than with a nagging wife in the house. So maybe you have a nagging wife. Maybe you have a nagging wife. Uh, and you are living on top of the when you enter the house you want to enter later and you say let me see because your house is not a happy home uh, maybe as a wife you do everything for your husband and your husband is not happy with you but when you cook your injera he says why can't you cook good food like other women so your home is not a happy home. Maybe you have lost your job or you have no source of income. Maybe it is your children that have become difficult and they don't want to follow the way of the Lord. Maybe you have tried everything you can but nothing seems to work out in your life. And you're asking God, how long? And you don't have the answer. Maybe you are trusting God that you are praying to God, you are living for God, but things are not working out for you. And you're asking how long? Maybe you are trusting God that you are praying to God, you are living for God, but things are not working out for you. The question we want to answer. I want to tell you, if you read from the book of 1 Samuel 2 verse 1, 1 Samuel 2 verse 1, Hannah after crying deep in anguish, not having a child, having Penina Making fun of her. Uh, when she went to the temple to pray, the priest Eddie was like, Have you drunk something? Why are you praying the way you are praying? Uh, and she was like, Why are you praying the way you are praying? As Hannah asked the question, How long? Maybe you are praying the way you are praying. You see, the book of Samuel 2 verse 1. Uh, the Bible says that Hannah was crying and she was crying. Uh, and she was crying. Uh, and she was crying. 
finally Hannah rejoiced in the Lord. That God is true for so long. God finally came through for him. Even with all the pain and the struggle that I had. From the accident to COVID. From the accident to COVID. I'm walking with my feet. I'm speaking with my voice. I am in the middle today. Because we serve a God that is faithful. From the book of Psalms 34, verse 18, will be our last verse. Uh, okay. I think we can do that. Uh, Psalms 34, verse 18. Psalms 34, verse 18. Psalms 34, verse 18. Well, well, and that being. That's boy. That's boy. Yeah. Uh, come back and one part of the end. Large and a punyal chaga can they eat in Siloikin? Tin Siloikin bath. And I'm not God is close to the broken hearted. Uh, Punyaka can eat in Siloikin. Even when you go through pain. That God has not left you even when you are in problem. Even when you ask God, how long? Even when you ask God, how long? Even you ask God, how long? Even when 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 you ask God, how long? Even you ask God, how long? you ask God, how long? Even when you ask God, how long? Even when you ask God, how long? Even when you ask God, how long? Me forever. You continue to hide your face. 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 You continue to hide your You hide your face. You hide your People keep laughing at you. Then they didn't you. God is close to the broken hearted. As we continue to try to answer that question. I'm just asking for that one person. Who is saying God though my life has a lot of problems? I know I'll continue to trust in you. Because you are close to the broken heart. I know that I've crushed in spirit. And you're saying, God, as I ask how long, I know you're with me. Even if I cannot see what you're doing, even if I cannot hear you, I know God, you are close to me. And I will learn to wait upon you. Uh, I will learn to wait upon you. Uh, so I don't know whether somebody saying, God, I'm struggling so much. Uh, but God, I know you are close to me. I know you are close to me. The broken hearted. I lift my hand, God, because I wait upon you. And the tomorrow I want to talk about strength in waiting upon the Lord. I will remind you and I'll continue to remind you. To raise your hand like this is a blessing. I had years that I could not raise my hand. Uh, God, don't take it for granted that I don't to raise your hand is a blessing from God. Don't take it for granted to raise your hand is a blessing from God. And if you are saying God, I'll continue to wait upon you. Uh, Even as I ask how long, I will learn to wait upon you. Uh, 
get tired at you raise like this and you go like this and then you put down a day would come where you can't do this but you are saying God even as I ask how long I know you are close to the broken hearted and I know you are with those that have crushed spirit I will continue to wait upon you if that is your prayer I want you to stand up I want you Father, we stand up with commitment that we want to learn to wait upon you. Even when we ask how long, we are suffering, we are in pain, we can't eat, sometimes we can't sleep. Sometimes our enemies are crowding around us, laughing at us and we don't know what to do. At times, oh Father, we wonder, where have you gone? We feel like you have abandoned us. But Lord, you have reminded us this day that you are close to the broken hearted and those with a crushed spirit. Amen. And we will learn to wait upon you. Father, we just want to pray this day, even as we are struggling in this world, you have reminded us that you knew us before we were made in our mother's womb. You picked us, had picked us, and created us. And Lord, regardless of the struggles, we know that we are fearfully and wonderfully made in your image by you, the creator divine. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen.